Hi everyone, my squad was here again. Another month's gone by. Another unboxing video, as usual. It's my nerd block, a sci fi one. <clears throat> I want to do this now because it has literally just arrived. Postman just knocked on the door, delivered it. As you can see, I haven't even unsealed it yet. For those that don't know, nerd block, subscription box, you pay a set amount each month. And they send you a box full of random stuff. With Nerd Block, they do it in themes. So you can have a box for arcade, computer games, that sort of thing. Box for comics, box for t shirts, horror. I get a sci fi block. These come from Canada, normally shipped out on about the 15th of every month. Uh, because it comes from Canada, it obviously takes two to three weeks to get here. The one thing with Nerd Block, is because of it's imported from abroad they have to have a customs form on it so always on the front you've got a customs declaration it tells you roughly what you're getting so I've not even looked at that one yet hand over it I don't want to know let's get on and see what we've got put the knife this time you see put it in and there we go so <clears throat> Oh, got some items of clothing. I'll put this one side to start with. I'll find out what they are in a minute. The first thing is a little badge. And for those that you can see that, it's a UFO abduction. I think that's the first time I've had a pin badge from uh, Nerdblock. That's actually quite a nice one. <clears throat> Next, we've got Judge Dread Year One Omnibus. That's nice, actually having a book in here. It says price in dollars, but I know this sort of thing over here is worth about $5.99 to $8.99. Judge Dread, I like 2080, I've always been a fan of Judge Dread. I actually do have a Dread book, and I thought it was year one, so it might be some of the stories in here. But it's actually a proper book. That's quite nice to have. I'd like to read that later. Next we have Mystery Science Theatre 3000 The Turkey Day Collection. So this is actually DVDs. Yeah, eight hours plus worth of DVDs. Now, I've never been a big fan of Mystery Science Theatre. I have seen some of them, just weren't the sort of thing for me. But again, this is actually a nice thing to have in a box. It's sealed, it's a nice metal tin. Uh, it looks quite nice. Yeah, we have a good one. And as usual, we've got an art print, a little poster there. Obviously, as it's October, it's been Halloween. This is Halloween Star Wars. So you've got R2, D2, C3PO, Han Luke, Leah, Obi Wan, and Chewie. All the zombies and lots of stormtroopers in the background. That's not a bad print, but I'm not a big fan of posters. But it's, it's, it's nice. The rest in there is just the uh, usual cards. So let's have a look see what we've got. First thing looks like a scarf. Quite a big one. It is a scarf, and it is quite a big one. Cool. There we go. When dinosaurs ruled the earth. It's a nice material, it's a bit stretchy, it's quite thick. That's quite a nice scarf. Don't wear scarves, but again, it's a nice quality, nice good item here. That's really nice. And then, as always, with no block, every month you get a t shirt. Let's see what this month's t shirt is. Okay, it's a unicorn. It's an origami unicorn. And the quote on the bottom is, all those moments will be lost in time like tears in the rain. Now that's brilliant for me because I've got it from the unicorn, even without the uh, quote on the bottom, but that is definitely a Blade Runner reference. Unicorn, obviously, is what is left by Gaff for Deckard. 
to sort of indicate that he may, might be a replicant. And quite at the bottom is Tears in the Rain, done by Roy Batty just as he's dying after fighting Deckard on the rooftops. I like that, that's a brilliant t-shirt for me. Again, good quality. It's always nice. Happy with that. So, real quick box unboxing today. However, I have to say, this is probably one of the best ones I've had off of the block for ages. Good quality book, I mean, a proper book, full on. It's not a graphic novel or anything like that, it's a proper novel. I like to read, so that's good. DVDs, okay, DVDs aren't expensive anymore, but this is a collector's one in a tin, so they are. That's, that's a nice little addition. A good quality pin badge. A really nice, decent t-shirt. And again, a nice, decent scarf. So two items of clothing that are really good. Some really good other goodies. Yeah, this is... This has got to be a 9, 10 out of 10 for this box. This is a really great box to have. An improvement over last month's one, which is a little bit of a downer. Uh, like I said before in the previous video, last month was probably the worst one I've had. This is going to rank around the top of all the ones I've had so far in the last year or so. And in fact, out of Nerd Block, Loot Crate, all the ones I've had over the last two years, this has probably been one of the best boxes ever. So, well done guys. Keep up the good work. And uh, until next month, Squire Twist saying, see you later.